Hi, my name is Monica Sanders. I'm a second year graduate student in the Marriage and Family Therapy Program here at San Diego State. I moved away to Sacramento State um, where I got my undergraduate degree in child development. I recognized that I love children after having 10 plus nieces and nephews of my own um, and then shortly learned after working with them in a school setting that I would inevitably have to work with families and parents um, which drew me back to San Diego um, where I'm now pursuing my marriage and family therapy degree. What I like best about the program that I'm in are the colleagues and friends that I've made in the process. Although that sounds a bit cliche, there is a part of this experience that has allowed me to connect to so many different people from various social locations. So currently I'm working at the D.B. Alpert Center, which is also known as the Center for Community Counseling and Engagement. Um, it's a bit of a surreal experience as I grew up just across the street um, from D.D. Alpert, um, maybe about 90 seconds away. Um, I remember as a child being able to play in the alley and on in the parking lot structure of D.D. Alpert and being told by security guards to get away and stop playing and be safe. Um, it's interesting now to be in activities with my classmates um, and looking over D.D. Alpert and remembering all of the memories that I had as a child. Um, I never anticipated being able to work in there. I more so uh, just thought it was an old building. Currently, I am a graduate assistant at the Black Resource Center, specifically with Harambe Scholars. Um, the organization basically focuses on incoming Black um, freshmen um, who need mentorship. Another part of my experience that I'm most proud of is learning my passion to want to connect to certain communities, um, such as homeless communities. Um, I went ahead and created kind of my own opportunity at a school called Monarch, um, which is a school dedicated to supporting um, homeless youth in San Diego. Um, what's special about that is I actually used to attend Monarch when I was a little girl and got reconnected this past year and learned that I wanted to be a, a, some form of support for the young women there. And so I helped um, another facilitator co-facilitate um, kind of an emotional um, support group for girls there. They are not an official site that I work with. Um, it's a way that I stay grounded and connected to my purpose here while I'm at San Diego State. Being a part of the Marriage and Family Therapy Association um, through my program has also been a, um, a huge pillar in my pride. Um, I am a treasurer um, of the organization and have had the amazing experience of working with very strong female leadership. Some hopes that I have in terms of my future career are being able to connect and represent a lot of my own intersections um, that make up my identity. This includes being able to work with families connected to the LGBTQIA plus community, as well as the black community. In addition to the support systems that I've found um, while being in my academic career, um, such as the colleagues I've made in MFTA, um, I've also found some of my greatest supports coming from my family members. Mm -hmm.